Hi everyone, welcome to Catherine's Plate. I'm Catherine. Thank you so much for coming to my show today, Vlogmas 22. Today is all about Christmas treats. <laughs> all right, just the fun things that you can make for Christmas. Now, I am going to be making some pretzel hugs and kisses bites. All right, that's what I'm going to call them anyway. All right, so we're going to need some pretzels. Now, I'm using these pretzel snaps here, and they look like that. I'm going to be using some M&Ms. Now, I've got some um, fancy Christmas colors here, red and green. <laughs> we're going to be using some hot cocoa kisses, and then I'm also going to be using hugs. So they're like white chocolate with chocolate kind of interspersed in it. All right, y'all, you're gonna need a pan, kind of one with a lip on it like this here, and just put some parchment paper down on it. Now I'm preheating my oven to 200 degrees because we don't wanna burn this or have it just really puddle, okay? We wanna just, just melt it enough to make these treats. All right, y'all, let's get started. All right, so we're just gonna go ahead now and lay out our pretzels, how many ever bites that you want. Now these will go really quick, so keep that in mind. So make a bunch. This is what I can, all I can say, make a bunch. All right, so when you have all of your pretzels laid out, this is when you're gonna start. You wanna make sure that you unwrap all of your hugs. So I'm using these milk chocolate hugs with white, let's see, white cream inside of them. That's what they call them. And then I'm also using hot cocoa kisses. When I cut this one in half, you can see that there's a um, little marshmallow inside. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead now and lay them all on top of my pretzels here. You wanna center them really good. All right, I'm gonna go ahead now and put this in my oven that's been preheating at 200 degrees for about four to six minutes. Y'all, please keep an eye on these. Once you start seeing them melt just a little bit on the top, it is time to pull them out. All right, I'll be back in just a few minutes. All right, y'all, just pull these out of the oven at the four minute mark. They're very glossy, which means they're nice and warm. And so I'm going to go ahead and put my M&Ms on these with the M side down. So I'm gonna lay it on the tip and just push with your finger just a little bit. And like that. All right, I think I have them all with the little M&Ms on top. So now what we want to do is solidify the chocolate. So we're gonna, we can let them sit on the counter for quite a while and let the chocolate harden. I'm going to put them in the refrigerator for about 10 minutes and let them solidify there. All right, and then we're going to come back and I'm going to show you what I'm going to do with them. All right, y'all, these are solidified and they are perfect little bites. All right. All right, so I'm gonna put them into my container here and show you how I'm gonna gift these. All right, y'all, there we go. You take these to a party, put them out at your house for Christmas, give them as a gift. These were so easy to make and just, I mean, the cost of this is just phenomenal, how many you can make. There's like 72 in this small container right here, y'all. That was it. All right. All right. Like that. All right, I'm going to try one for you. You know I am. All right, take two. Uh, hopefully don't let that doesn't happen again. <laughs> Not even sure how it happened the first time. All right, we're going to try this one here. Mmm. <laughs> Okay, mm. the saltiness of the pretzel and the sweetness of the, the hug and the M&M mixed together, such a delicious Christmas treat. All right, for my second Christmas treat, I am making peanut clusters. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna be using a white chocolate and I'm also gonna be using a semi-sweet chocolate and these are chocolate chips here. So I'm going to melt these in the microwave and then um, I'm going to be right back and show you what our next step is going to be. 
All right, so I have my chocolates melted from the microwave. I put them in individually for 30 seconds. Then I would stir it just using one of these skewers, put it back in until I got a smooth consistency. All right, that's what I was looking for right there. And my white chocolate over here too. All right, so now what we're gonna do is I have some dry roasted peanuts here. And I'm going to go ahead and add half a cup to each batch here. And we're going to start with that and see what we have. And we're just going to mix it up. All right, so they're all coated, and I still have quite a bit of chocolate in there. So I'm going to go ahead and add about another quarter cup. So half of this. And we're going to give that a mix. So I'm ready to go ahead and start making my little peanut clusters. Now I'm using a mini muffin tin here with little mini muffin tin cups, all right? Because I'm gonna be using these for gifts. I'm going to pull them out and put them in these nice little containers here to give them as gifts, all right? You could also put them on a tray lined with parchment tape paper. Just put like a little teaspoonful dab them along the way, and then let them solidify, and then you can pull them off and put those into containers also. All right, let's get started. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I got two, two teaspoons here to kind of help here. So I'm going to kind of grab some of my spoon here. I'm gonna use this spoon right here to kind of help pull it out. So I'll put it right in there, just like that. All right, so I have them all filled, and I'm going to put these in the refrigerator for about 10 to 20 minutes, or you can put them in the freezer for faster results. What we want to do is solidify the chocolate on here. All right, so I've just pulled my peanut clusters out of the freezer. They solidified very nicely. I'm going to put them in my little tin here. All right, y'all, so I got my bottom layer in there. Now you can lay like a piece of parchment tape paper on top of there and then put another layer if you would like. So I'm just showing you options here. All right, everyone, I want to thank you so much for coming to my show today, Vlogmas number 22. I have my peanut clusters and my pretzel bites that I did for you for my Christmas treats. All right, comment down below, give me a thumbs up, and if you're new, make sure you hit that subscribe button with the bell notification so that you know when my shows are posted. All right, y'all, I will see you on my next Vlogmas Day.